Hello and welcome back to another video here on The Faith Life with me, Kev. In the last video, I asked you guys to chuck some thoughts about what you would like to discuss uh, on future videos and um, I've had some of you respond, which is really great, uh, and I just wanted to update you on the fact that those videos will be being put together in the next couple of weeks, so expect those to be dropping um, from hopefully next week. And there is still time to have your say, so if you are, if you have a topic you want to talk about or anything like that, then you can still do so in the comments, you can um, email me, or you can send me a message on Instagram. So please make sure that you do that if you have anything that you want um, to be covered. Uh, it can be, as I said in the last video, it can be as crazy as you like, it can be as wacky as you think it may be, um, or it can be uh, as serious as you want it to be. Uh, and I'll try and cover uh, all the topics that you guys uh, want to talk about. In today's video, we're going to be doing another update on the COVID-19 situation. Um, it is something that is still very much a reality in our lives and in our world. Um, so uh, I think it's important for us to keep talking about it. I think it's healthy for us to talk about it in a constructive way. So that's what we're going to be doing today. Um, and we're going to be thinking about uh, COVID-19 and the effect that it might be having um, on our mental health and our mental well-being. Now, obviously, uh, the updates that have happened uh, recently in the UK um, are that we are now allowed to go out for uh, exercise uh, for as much as we like, and we're allowed to meet with one other person from another household, provided that we are one outside and two are keeping at least two metres away. Um, so that hopefully means that there will be a, a better space for us to um, improve our mental health and our, our mental attitude towards uh, what has been a horrible and terrible situation that we have been going through recently. Now, for some of us, uh, we may have found this not too tricky, uh, this whole having to be on lockdown, only being allowed out for an hour exercise. Um, for me personally, I am, uh, I am an introvert by nature, so um, actually not being able to go and see lots of people and only being out, out for an hour a day hasn't been too tricky uh, I mean I like being outside so only being allowed out for an hour a day has been quite difficult but now we're allowed out for more than that I think hopefully that will help me to improve um, my sort of uh, mental well-being um, but I know for others of you that actually uh, being around people if you're an extrovert then you thrive on being around people uh, and it has probably been really really difficult for you not to be able to do that um, so I if you've been struggling with that and if you are still struggling with that I really just want you to know that you can reach out to me and uh, we can I'll be there to talk to or if you want uh, somebody to pray for you then I am also there for that so please do reach out and utilize that resource um, I've said it before and I'll say it again even if you don't think there is much in prayer it doesn't hurt to get prayed for and you may well be surprised by what happens now thankfully we're in a situation now where we can go out as much as we like and we can meet with, as I said, one other person from another household provided we stay the two metres apart and we're outside. Great. Hopefully that will see an improvement in people's uh, well-being, both meaning they can get more exercise but also it means they can be, interact with people that are outside of their home, they can see some of their friends. Uh, and I think it's really important that, yes, we still keep in contact with people and socialize distantly pulling it back guys uh, because we're not going to get to meet with groups of friends like we have been able to that's probably not going to happen for a little while uh, so we need to make sure that we are still committing to chatting to people online via facetime via zoom how whatever it may be i'm going to continue to be playing xbox with my friends in a party chat to hang out and catch up with them but I think it's also important that if there are people around that are near us that we that are you know they live a 10 minute walk away utilize the ability to go and hang out with them you can even play tennis tennis with people now provided you keep that two meters apart and I think it's the same with I think they said the same sort of thing with football as well like you can go and kick a ball around um, the difficult thing I think at the moment is that it can only be with one other person from another household um, so obviously there's still going to be difficulty for us. What I want to encourage you with as a Christian is that I may not be able to see all the people that I want to see at the same time. Um, I may feel still feel that I am somewhat isolated, um, but God is always with us 
uh, and he's always there to talk to you know we can we can pray and if we listen we may hear god answer us um you know it doesn't always work like that but sometimes it does and that you know maybe may surprise you um but also uh, as a christian i am able to do that on your behalf if you don't feel that you want to pray you don't feel like prayer will do anything um then just you know send me a message i'll pray for you i'll pray for you guys i'm more than happy to do that um and you know maybe god will do something amazing now i'm going to keep this uh, keeping this video fairly short and sweet because i just wanted to um touch base with you guys on the whole covid situation um and just kind of keep you in the loop of what's going on in my life and in the uk uk's life um and yeah just encourage you guys and just sort of let you know that i'm still here for you guys and yeah whatever i can do i will be doing um so please do consider reaching out and as i said at the beginning of the video i am going to be start doing your topics from next week so keep them coming in keep me keep them coming don't think that just because i said it in that one video that that's the only time you can do it but i'm going to keep mentioning it so you guys think oh i actually yeah i kind of wish i'd asked about dot 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 but i didn't do it so maybe now it's too late it's not too late you can still do it um so yeah that's gonna be it for this video i just wanted to yeah say look after yourself still utilize the fact you can go outside as much as you like now you'd be um, absolutely amazed at how uh, that can positively impact you um, you know, we can let ourselves spiral down when we're stuck inside and our, our, we, all we have is our mind and it's like going round and round, it's like a tornado. Um, take the space, go outside, go for a walk, you know, especially when it's a really nice day. Clear your mind of all the, all the rubbish that you wish wasn't swirling around there and, and yeah, just distract yourself by being outside and, you know, grab a friend that you can meet with and walk awkwardly two meters apart from them um, but at least you're able to catch up with somebody else as well so please do that um, and yeah just look after yourselves guys that's it for this video then guys thank you so much for watching i hope you have found it helpful if you have any questions or you have anything that you would appreciate prayer for uh, or if you have any topics for us to look at in future videos then please do reach out via email or instagram um, or in the comment section below as always if you have enjoyed the video then please do give it a like the support is super appreciated and it just helps build up the channel's numbers for more videos to become more visible on youtube and all that sort of stuff uh, so it just helps that the channel to grow and as always if you haven't yet subscribed to the channel but you would like to then please do hit the subscribe button down below again that support is super appreciated um, and the support so far has been absolutely amazing uh, you guys are great uh, and I'm really excited to just see where this channel goes with your guys' support. So thank you for that. And don't forget, you can also hit up them socials. You have got Facebook and Instagram and the links for those are in the description below. So do please consider dropping a like and a follow over there as well. And that is it from me until the next video, guys. I hope you all are doing well. I hope that the progress that the UK has made, if you are in the UK, has uh, been beneficial and you found it uh, good news that you're able to to do more stuff now and hopefully fingers crossed and praying that we just continue to go on a on an upward trend and soon we will get back to uh, a new normal so look after yourselves guys and i will see you all on the next one goodbye my friends